Ya ho, YouTube. I'm Super Genki. And in today's video, we're going to go over some beginner tips for aspiring positive thinkers. Recently, I have been going out and interviewing a lot of people about the power of positive thinking. To everyone who said yes and helped me out with my interview, thank you very much. But I also want to say it wasn't just to ask you to subscribe to my channel. That being said, let's start off with tip number one. Define positive thinking for yourself. The first question I asked in my interview was, do you think positive thinking is important? The overwhelming majority of people said yes, but there were a couple of people that went on to say, what do you mean by positive thinking? It's a rather vague and generalized concept. I personally think it helps to transform it into something more tangible. For example, when I'm asked to define positive thinking, I almost always say, an optimistic look at the past, using that optimism to build upon the present in order to better craft the direction you want to head in the future. You'll have to be able to build upon the experiences you made in the past, Japan, use those experiences in the present YouTube channel to move towards your goals. Super Genki! Tip number two. Yes slash no, it's important to do it every day. The second question I asked in my interview was, do you think it's important to think positively every single day? The majority of people said yes, but there was a larger minority of people that said no. Both answers are correct. But if you say no, again, I find it helps to be more specific with your answer. Most people's answers were along the lines of, it's an unrealistic expectation. Rather than framing it in this state of mind, I would recommend looking at it in the form of contrast. How would you ever understand the value of the light if there was no dark to contrast in? The same thing with positive thinking. How would you ever understand positive thinking if you didn't understand negative thinking? And finally, tip number three, would you like to subscribe to my channel? This was the final question in my interview and perhaps the most important. Again, to all of the people that did subscribe to my channel, thank you. But understand that the number of people that will approach you in your life with a positive message comparatively speaking to the number that have other motives, is less than 1%. So my final tip is don't undervalue the people that do. If someone tries to have a positive impact on your life, value them. It doesn't have to be me necessarily, but take what they say seriously. Those are my three beginner tips to all of you young positive thinkers out there. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a comment, subscribe to the channel, and share this video with your friends. It's so important because we need to get the good word of positive thinking out there to as many people as possible. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.